Hello everyone and welcome back to Wolf Quest 2.7 and we are here with our puppies. Come on you guys, don't wander away. We are here with our little puppies, Atlas, Celestial, Nightlight, and Solar, who are here waiting for us to bring them back some food. Twilight's coming back, so we're gonna run off. Oh good, and the storm has stopped. But we are gonna run off to the elk hunting ground right now, where we actually should have, oh, there's a couple elk carcasses over there. Yeah, we took down one of these elk not too long ago, where we have some food and we're gonna bring it back to our puppies, but our puppies are born! So Eclipse is now a proud parent. He now has his very first litter of puppies with his beautiful mate, Twilight. And we are trying to make sure that our puppies survive. So, so far we're doing a good job at keeping our territory very firmly established so that all the other wolves in the area know whose zone this is, and this is our area. But, ah, oh, dang it, there's the rest of that carcass. Here's the, the elk that we actually took down last time. But now our job is to work on feeding up our puppies and making sure that they are going to be protected. So far we haven't had any predators show up, but we really, oh, pack affinity is going down. I need to get over there. I need to remind the puppies to stay where they belong because they will try to run off on us and that would be not a good thing. Oh my goodness, but it is so much easier to feed and take care of our little babies now, just so you guys know. I'll show you that when we get back over there. I think Twilight is stopping to feed everybody. Look at the leaves going by. Oh my gosh. And all the little bushes to dodge between. I haven't seen any hares or coyotes or hawks or grizzlies yet, but I would bet you that that is going to be coming up pretty soon. And we'll check on how well our puppies are growing soon. There you go, Twilight. Tag. I'm in. And we can actually play with our puppies now. Look at this. Hey, you guys. Hi. Yeah, what do you think? What do you think? But they're really hungry, so they're like, I think I want fed more than anything. I want fed more than anything, Dad. So let's go through. Oh my gosh! You did not try to come over here. Get out of here. There. What does he think he's doing? That is not appropriate. I'm peeing on all the things now. He's trying to break into my territory. Did you see the cheek? Did you see the cheek of that little coyote? Thinking that he can just come over and mess with my babies. Not happening. But it's much easier to feed the puppies now. You just kind of have to line up on them and then go ahead and click the feed button. And it used to be like you'd have to line up just right and it was so difficult, but this is much easier to handle. So far, I say this. I say this and it may be famous last words. Like, where are you going, Atlas? Are you gonna play with your siblings? Are you guys playing together? Nightlight, what do you think? You want more food? All right, that's all the food I have. Atlas, stay here. They don't have very high pack affinity just yet, so I'm really hoping that if I keep picking them up and putting them... Atlas, how'd you get back in my mouth? I don't I don't know how that happened. But I keep hoping if I keep... Atlas! <laughs> okay, so apparently Atlas is a daddy's boy. So we kept picking him up. All right, come here, Nightlight. I'm hoping... We're Celestial. There's Celestial. There, look at that. The affinity is going up so high. So the... Nightlight! So the blue uh, little meter you can see is the pack affinity or how well our pack kind of sticks together, how well the babies will stay. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Let's do a little howl. Oh, look at them. Mission complete. Congratulations. You have taught your pups to stay nearby to keep safe. You are ready to continue your quest for survival. Oh boy, here we go. Oh boy, it's coming. Defend your pups. Your pups are enticing and defenseless targets for predators of all kinds. Though your pups are now likely to stay closer to home, you and your mate must be vigilant to protect them. Defend your den and pups while you continue to mark your territory and train and feed your pups. All right, so we need to go ahead... We're going to mark our territory a little bit with the howling. What do you think about that, babies? Oh, I love them. I just love them. I just want to play so much with all of them. Oh, that's so cute. That's just the best. Oh, solar. Solar. There's a coyote right there. What? No, get out of here. This is not happening. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You think you can come just eat my baby? That's not how this works. Not how this works at all, sir. All right, there we go. I need to like mark my territory around here because they should know better than to be trying that nonsense. What the heck? There's carcasses over here? Well, let's go swing over there and we'll pick up some carcasses. And also, that would be good to try to clean that up out of here so it doesn't attract more scavengers. Twilight, Twilight, she's like, I sensed a coyote. They're coming for our babies. All right, so let's go ahead. We'll finish off these carcasses take back what's over here. There's another one right over there. 
Is that entering stranger wolf pack territory? I think it is. I'm not so sure about that. Your pups are now safe inside the den until you return. Well, we can actually adventure quite a bit. I know many of you want me to, oh my gosh. You guys look, I think that's the rival wolf pack. Are they just out playing? What? Oh boy, did they see us? Oh boy, I'm gonna try to scavenge. Look at them, they're all lined up in the distance. Would they attack us? Warning, stranger to wolf territory. All right, well we won't go over here. But they are really letting us know. Wow, they look so cool. So they're letting us know that this is their territory. Well, let's go back to where we belong. Because I know that it's pretty safe over here. Hopefully they won't be curious. They're all grown wolves, so I really don't want them to be curious enough and think that they can try to make some, make some marks into this territory. All right, so let's come back over here. We're going to feed the puppies. Oh, I thought they were going to be safe. I thought the, the, the word on the street was that my puppies were safe until I got back. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, we got to chase the grizzly bear off. I think we got to get like three strong bites into the grizzly bear's rump. All right, get out of here. Get out of here. That's right. You better get away. And you can't, I don't think you can like defeat the grizzly bear. No way, can you really? He's not a very good grizzly bear. Can you really defeat him? Get out of here, grizzly bear. All right, well, we chased him away, and that's what matters. Oh, and the storm is back. Oh, man, I love it when the storms come. I wonder if we can change what time of day it is now, too. All right. Oh, look at them. They actually stayed in the den. Oh, there's a coyote. No way. Oh, things are, like, heating up. All right, what do you think you're doing, huh? What do you think you're doing? Get out of here. All right. Oh my gosh. There's more coyotes and everything's starting to show up. So things are getting a little intense. Let's go ahead and start feeding the babies. I can't believe a grizzly just showed up. Like, my puppies are safe inside the den, it said. Well, you know, that's where having a little bit of self-preservation and being very silent puppies hiding inside of our little den spot right here probably saved their lives. So I really hope that's the case. All right, let's feed everybody. And then I think I'm going to pick some of them up. I also need to pee. Oh, boy. That tree. Atlas? Another coyote? He's coming for you? No, he's not. I'm not going to let him get you, Atlas. Don't you worry. Dad's on this. And the tree's on fire. And there was a grizzly bear. And there's the coyote. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't, buddy. Oh, it's so much easier to be able to hunt them now. Controls are amazing. Oh my gosh. All right, let's come down here. How are the babies? Are they doing good? Do I need to pick them up? All right, Celestial, I'm gonna pick you up. They're getting hungrier faster too, so we're gonna have to work on that. All right, so Affinity's up. All right, Dad needs to pee on a few things. We're losing some of our pack, uh, like pr territory markers, and those stranger wolves, if we get too low, might decide to come and see, oh my goodness. They might decide to come and see what we're up to. That tree again. Man, Twilight. I don't know about that. It just catches fire so often. Careful over there, Twilight. I'm trying to get a good view of everything. Oh my gosh. All right, well, let's try howling. Because that really increases pack affinity too. There's a coyote. I see a coyote. There is a coyote. He is in vicinity of my babies. This is going to be a little interesting. So we really need to work on raising the puppies as quickly as we can. Get out of here. All right. We need more. We need more elk. All right, Twilight. Let's go take down another elk. Or you can stay and guard the puppies. Either either is good. All right. She's coming with us. I think we're going hunting together. So let's move our way into the elk herd. And let's see if we can find where they have disappeared to. This is already getting pretty... Oh, my gosh. Pretty intense again. There's no scent but they should be showing up soon. The frogs are happy with all this rain. My gosh, I can't believe the trees have already caught on fire. Oh, there they are. Twilight. All right. Oh my goodness, and the lightning is just striking everything. Will the lightning strike an elk for us? That would be exceedingly convenient. All right, there's a healthy cow elk. There's a not so healthy cow elk. We'll pick her out of the group. Wait for it. Ah, she saw us. All right. Turn her, turn her, turn her, turn her, turn her. That's what we want. 
Nope, keep going, keep going. I want you right there. I'm gonna send you directly to the den. This would be perfect. Uh, 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 uh. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Come on, get her, get her, Twilight, get her, get her. Oh, she's like zigging, zagging. Hit the tree. No, no, I don't wanna hit the tree. I want you to hit the tree. No, don't run for it over there. All right, Twilight, Twilight, wait, Twilight. Twilight, hang on. All right, Twilight didn't want to hang on. All right, hang on, Twilight, let's come this way. It really helps if we can push the elk kind of towards where the den is. All right, let's see if we can get her again. I need to grab on. Come on, bite, 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 and rest. All right, is Twilight gonna be able to get her? Come on, Twilight. I'm gonna have to walk after you to regain some stamina. Stamina, I can't decide. What do you guys think is better, stamina or strength? We, we took some kicks. The puppies are getting so hungry. Oh my gosh, I need my stamina back. All right, we're gonna sneak, sneak, sneak. Oh, she saw us anyway. All right, let's do this. She shouldn't have much left in her. Come on. And she should be turning to fight now. And to the neck, to the neck, to the neck, to the jugular. I'm sorry. There we go. Oh, geez. All right. So now we're going to hurry. I need to eat. The puppies are so hungry. We're going to go feed our little babies. All right. Oh, I can hear the frogs. I'm so scared that we're going to go back there and there's going to be like a coyote. But that is kind of like the self-preservation thing of the animals again. Where if the puppies are instinctually following what they should do, they should be a little bit quiet when they're completely unsupervised. They should hopefully stay exactly where they should be, kind of like a baby deer. will hold completely still and will just hide in the grasses and it'll do its best not to be discovered, not to move. And that's important for the babies. All right, do I, do I see a coyote? Do I sense a coyote? Are you guys okay? Please tell me you're not dead of hunger. I'm sorry, I'll try to hunt faster. Are you guys okay? Hi, little ones. Oh my gosh, you're all so hungry. Oh my goodness, it's so much harder to keep everybody fed. All right, come on, Twilight. Are you gonna do it? Oh, she's playing with our babies. And she's feeding them. Celestial is totally fed now. Solar, mom and dad are feeding you. You should be completely topped off. Oh, good job, Twilight. Are you feeding Nightlight? Yes. Yes. We are. We are fantastic parents. I would say we're, we're really, really, really good parents. We're doing great. The puppies are cute. They're playing with each other. Things seem to be do moving pretty well. Whoops, doops. Yes, things seem to be moving pretty well. We're being fantastic parents, if you ask me. Uh, except for the fact that Atlas is trying to wander off again. Gotta get that pack affinity up. I think they're so safe when we leave. My guess would be because pack affinity is high and they, they should stay at their den. Like, that's how I would do it if I was if I was a proud parent. All right, proud, oh, wolf, there we go. All right, so hopefully you guys will stay there. And our territory markers are hitting critical. So, all right, we're gonna pee on everything really quickly. Try to get it at least up to 70 again. Poor Eclipse, he must have to drink so much water to do all of this. All right, so there's 70, doing good. Gotta run over here, Eclipse, are you helping? I think she's helping, or right, Twilight's helping. There we go. All right, hopefully the puppies are helping too. All right, 74, 75, 77, 78, 79, 80. Pups are now safe inside the den until we return. That's fine, that's good. All right, we're almost there. Come on, Twilight. And this may seem tedious, but this is just as important a part of the daily life of what these wild animals have to do as going and finding food and taking care of their young, establishing this territory is how they'd establish where their food is going to be. It's how they establish where the safety for their young is going to be. It's how they establish where safety for themselves is going to be. So getting this territory marker like absolutely high up there and letting everybody in the area know this is my zone is absolutely important. So let's try howling. Oh man. They are really so beautiful. And all the little babies are making some noise with us. And there we go, 100% our territory. All right, well, let's go ahead and feed a couple of the puppies with whatever we've got left. And then I'll have to see you guys next time 
when we will work on feeding them up some more and hopefully getting them ready for the summer. So I will see you guys then. And Twilight looks like she's already ready to go hunting again. So we'll join her next time and I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.